so morning three we're leaving big water chicky in the rain so i don't know how much filming i'm going to get done today we've had coffee and breakfast already the canoe's all packed up and we got a short paddle to floyd's island today but this is a beautiful campsite absolutely love it looks exactly what you would think of for swamp camping So this area here is a particularly beautiful area. This is between Big Water and Floyd's uh, Island. And this is kind of what I was thinking when I see pictures of the Okefenokee Swamp. The cypress are everywhere. You've got Spanish moss everywhere. It is absolutely gorgeous. And right on cue, as soon as the camera comes out, the rain starts again. It's not, hasn't been bad. Hasn't been bad for rain, but it's uh, just an annoying, annoying rain. Should be a lot worse. So this is our turn to Floyd's. Back here, you can see the sign. So the main trail would go ahead. And Floyd's is actually a s small island, and there's... A, there's a cabin on it, and there is a portage. This is the only portage on the trip, and it's a pretty short one. So the trail to Floyd's definitely is narrower. So we're looking for we're looking for Floyd's cabin and everything's been really well marked here except for this yeah this is 100% it I don't see a lot of tracks but there's only a canoe a day through here so we made it to Floyd's Island and the trail just stops and it's a pretty legit island Pretty cool. We can see the cabin's roof line. So we'll go scout out the cabin, but it's nice to stand up and walk around, use the bathroom. Very little signs of life here though. They do a great job maintaining this place. So we just got a short little walk to the cabin. And it is pretty cool. Wow, this is nice. For two guys who've been getting rained on all day, this is like a dream come true. I was expecting like a lean to like a shelter. Yeah, I was too. This is amazing. Look at this. It's pretty cold in here, though, I'll say that. Yeah, I like how they board up the fireplace. Nice. So you could definitely do a lot worse than this for an evening. The cabin on Floyd's Island is 
first-class accommodations.